Here at RNA Scott, we hold the MAN Truck and Bus UK franchise for Gainsborough and the surrounding area. But we don't just service and repair trucks, we do cars as well. Our competitive car service and MOT packages start from as little as £99 and include parts, labour and VAT. But we're not just fanatical about vehicles, we are passionate about football too and are proud to sponsor Gainsborough Trinity. Well Steve, for me that was a game in three parts. You lost your striker at the beginning of the game to injury inside five minutes. You took control with a 2-0 lead and then you held on under tremendous pressure at the end to take three points, really did well. Yeah, you know, good battling performance in the end but, you know, it should have been dead and buried. We're coming at half time comfortable, starting the second half comfortable as well and, you know, just one little sniff for them and 2 nils always a, uh, you know, we say a horrible scoreline and it proved to be. Um, but we've come out with a three points, we've dug deep in the end. Um, they didn't really come into the game until they scored their goal. And then all of a sudden... Did, did you think that was a penalty? From where we, we was, yeah. You know, I, I thought it was. Uh, I thought Josh was quite caught with the wrong side of his player. Cute little ball and there. Josh is un unaware of his man. Um, but, you know, as a kid, he's, he's learning. You know, credit to him, he's 19, 20 year old. You know, he's played uh, every game this season, so he's going on leaps and bounds. And he'll learn from them little mistakes. And, uh, you know, it, it didn't come back in the end to cost us. Now, a great clearance from your young left back at the end of the game. Where it looked, looked it like it had looped over Jan and it was going in, and he appeared from nowhere to put it out for the corner. It was, you know, it was nerve wracking stuff. Uh, Jan's come from, you know, I don't know what he's catching there, uh, flies or something, you know, it's gone straight over him. And uh, great awareness, you know, we've said before. What Courtney is about, and you know, a full back, um, his attributes, and great cover from the young lad, and uh, credit to him. Could have smashed himself into the, the post at the same time, but you know, we, we, we worked on a lot of things in training Thursday and Tuesday where set pieces and that are causing us problems, and being brave in both boxes, and that shows that he, he was brave there. What really won you the game was the two goals just before half time. Liam Davies, who you recall to the side, won a penalty for you. I think that's the first penalty of the season, yeah, I think. Yeah, Simon Russell scoring, and then Liam Davies a few minutes later scoring himself with a near post header. Yeah, we, you know, we brought Liam in just to, uh, you know, defensive side of it, because we knew Greg Mills could be a problem down that side, so we wanted that doubling up, which would give uh, Kane the license to, to use his pace on one side and uh, Liam defensively on the other. And, uh, you know, knew he just in the hole behind him. Uh, but that didn't last long, you know, because uh, I know he's unfortunate injury. Yeah, but, you know, Jamie's come on, um, you know, he would have been down about being outside, but he's come on and credit to him. I thought he was superb again today. Um, so, and, and Liam's took his chance really well um, in the side. And I'm, I'm pleased for them all, but like you say, the negatives the last 15, 20 minutes when they've got their goal. But, you know, credit to them as well because they dug, dug deep and uh, held on for the result. And now he's Mark Newsham. Was it the challenge or did he go over on his ankle? No, he's gone over, you know, it's very heavy pitch. You know, it looks great when you walked, walked into the stadium and uh, when you got on it, it was very, very sodden and uh, I think he just landed off. Um, similar to what he did at Stanford in pre-season, but hopefully not as bad and, uh, you know, we'll just have to assess that this week. And it must have been very frustrating for you as a manager because you brought in Craig Reid last week. He got 90 minutes with Noose. She hadn't met him since before the game. Got 90 minutes, they've got an understanding and then suddenly that's gone and you have to move Kane Richards alongside him and they have to start learning all over again. Exactly, you know, um, and it, it could be what we have next week as well because I can't see Noose being right. Obviously John is still suspended. Groves is still suspended. Um, so. You know, but Kane is a striker as well as a, as a wide man, so that, that's something we can look at next week. We'll have to wait and see. He's got abundance of pace. Um, you know, but like I said, we'll, we'll just hope he recovers uh, very speedy. Thank you very much.